How's it going everyone? Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video we're going to be taking a look at my force feedback settings in-game uh, and for the Fanatec app. Uh, just because I've had a few questions on uh, what my settings are and stuff like that so we're just going to do a quick run through of what they are. Alright. Settings for force feedback. Uh, right here. I'm not going to go through what uh, what each one does or anything like that. It has a little description right next to it. I'm just going to go through them quickly. And then also what you want to do, if you have a wheel, is at the end of the tuning make sure you adjust this uh i found for me that the the best for most cars at least in the gt class uh 80 percent seems to be pretty decent uh you get about 180 degrees rotation maybe a little bit more than that it might be uh 360 i'm not sure but uh if you have it at 100 the steering is going to feel really i don't know just kind of like not delayed in a way, but you're not going to be, you're going to have to turn the wheel way more than what you feel like you should. Um, and then I turn up the force feedback just a little bit. And then the Fantex settings. Uh, yeah, uh, nothing really going on here. I just turn the damper down all the way. And then, yeah, make sure you set your... Uh, your zero. Make sure your uh, wheel zeroed out. Uh, I'm trying to think if I changed anything else here. Yeah, no, that's it. Just uh, I turned down the dampening, and then yep, just make sure you got your this at around 80. You know, you can play with it a little bit to find out what's most comfortable for you. But for me, I found. 80 between like 77 and 80 is the uh is the sweet spot for me anyways i hope that helps at least some of you guys out and uh get you guys in the next one peace